ですね、えー、直前の公開練習です、えー、浜さん、はい、タイソンはこういったスパーリングでも,もう全力を尽くすというスパーリングを見せますよねですからスパーリングパートナーとしたらもう体痛んで大変でしょうね、えー、まあこの実際このスパーリングもあの相手の声が聞こえてきましたからね、同じ声っていうんですかね、はいまあ、かなりタイソンは大柄なスパーリングパートナーを集めてこう、スポーツサイリング、however、did not last。For just days before he was scheduled to meet Buster Mathis Jr., the bout was abruptly cancelled. Re injured the thumb on Monday while training in Las Vegas after first hurting it about three weeks ago in training. There's the fight barker. Tyson went five rounds in the gym, says the thumb's okay, says he's fighting fit. Da 45 anni, qui invece vediamo il vero e Tyson scatenato in allenamento, becca un destro da parte di Nate Tubbs can attest to that. Hit me, I am a pinata. There's been talk that Tyson has been erratic in sparring, but there are still signs that Bruno faces an awesome punching machine. For Tyson's second stop in the comeback trail, sparring partners were seeing stars all week long from Tyson's brutal rehearsal. I thought Mike was aggressive. He certainly has fast hands and he's powerful. He's going to need more than that to become heavyweight champion of the world again with a guy like Riddick Bowe out there. But this is 1996, with a three-year gap in his resume caused... Mr. Crocodile is Tyson's official motivator. He's confident about his employer's chances, along with the rest of the camp. These are scenes from Tyson's only public sparring session so far. He looked poor. Though the camp keep telling us that really he's been in sparkling form. Bruno gonna jump off the London Bridge. We gonna make him jump off the London Bridge. We sitting him back there, beltless. What else? Tyson hit the scales at 220 pounds. Frank Bruno, the WBC title holder, stepped in with a little more flesh. He was 247.
Bruins reach advantage, and here we go, round one. I tell you what, if I was built like Frank Bruno, I wouldn't be afraid of anybody or anything, but Mike Tyson is a phenom. A lot of problems as to whether Tyson's going to come bobbing and weaving. He's certainly coming. What you're going to see is Frank Bruno grab Mike when he comes in like that. Every time. Every time he comes in, he's going to hold him. He's not going to let Mike do what Mike wants to do with the jab inside. to keep Tyson away. He does not like to fight on the inside generally. Un abnormal strength, unnatural. He is a walking powerhouse. Tyson's trainer, Jay Bright, said he's concerned about keeping Tyson under control of the belt. He'll be very anxious. Hey, hey, Bruno hey. continues to oh. hold and hit. Quit grabbing. Come on. Quit grabbing, says Mills Lane. Tyson's people wanted to bob and roll. Be less of a target attack from the angles. Oh, ferocity, they can stop worrying. He is fierce tonight. Frank Bruno, that's the first one he felt the steam. Didn't seem to do anything, but it was a nice effort. And any time, oh, here comes Tyson. Tyson with a combination. Here you see where Tyson wobbles him with a big right hand. Right on the button. Browns, I guarantee you. Oh, a left hook by Mike Tyson. Flush on the face of Frank Bono. Another left and a combination by Tyson. Didn't land clean, but there's more behind that. Mike threw a nice counter right hand. And this is what Bruno expected. He said he's not looking for the Tyson of Fort McGinley. Here's a combination uppercut by Tyson. Eight and on, carry it on. Down goes Bruno into the ropes. And, and it is all over. It is all over here in round three. Mike Tyson is champion again. And that is it. Mike Tyson is back. The Tyson era has begun. Let's take a look at how Tyson took care of business. Ducked under. A shot under the arm in the legs. And from here on out, a rain of punches which buckled Frank Bruno until he was helpless. If you let Mike Tyson get that kind of leverage with that right uppercut, you will not make it through the round, never mind the fight. He is a finisher par excellence. And he finished tonight, and Frank Bruno had no chance. A ferocious display by Mike Tyson. You would see the knees buckle if we had a bigger angle. Bruno is out, and now it's just a matter of pummeling and finishing the job. The coup de grace, done. Well, what is it that I gotta look forward to? I'm just looking forward to winning. My main objective is just to win. I don't care if no one thinks about my career or anything, you know what I mean? Like I say, you know, I was fortunate enough to save this. Seriously, I'm going to beat up a lot of guys and I'm going to take myself serious and I'm going to just try this one time to do right there.
on them, be effective, throw a lot of combination. Plan is the world's worst kept secret, unbridled aggression. for the official weigh-in for our main event champion versus champion for the WBA heavyweight title. Please welcome up to the scale. He is the current WBC heavyweight champion of the world. Here is Iron Mike Tyson. Mike always has his hands high, springing, trying to come down under. He hits him on the top of the head. He hits him just on top of, I mean, and the softest part of your head is the very top of your head. Bobby, the, the crowd is reacting. It looked like at first that Steele was waving. Right in the head, Bert, you're exactly the right. right. hand, and it was stunned him. He had a nice long rest there, but he has felt. Back comes Sheldon. All right, now Mike's coming in. He senses the kill. There's the left hook. Bruce goes back to the ropes and down. The crowd is booing. I hear him in the background. I'll tell you why they're booing, Steve. They don't believe those were legitimate shots for heavyweight champions to be knocked out with. And I have to somewhat agree. I don't think. And Tyson with a left hook and Sheldon is down.
We present the challenger to the scale. He is the former undisputed cruiserweight and former undisputed heavyweight champion of the world. Introducing Evander, the real deal, a holy field. 215 pounds, 215 pounds. Introducing Iron Mike Tyson. 222 pounds, 222 for the champion. Stones if you live in the glass house And if you got a glass jaw, you should watch your mouth Cause I'll break your face Have your ass running, mumbling to the J You're going against me, dawg, you're making a mistake I split your leader looking like the Michael Jackson jackets With all them zippers I'm the boss on this boat, you can call me Skipper The way I turn the money over, you should call me Flipper Your bitch a regular bitch, you calling a wifey I fuck them feet up fast food, you keeping her icy I'm down to sell records, but not my soul Snoop said this in 94 We don't love them hoes, I got pennies for my talks, now I'm rich See the 20 spinning looking mean on the sits Niggas wearing flags Cause the colors match their clothes, they get caught in the wrong hood They fill it with holes, motherfucker You should be ready for a track and screw on You get stunned if you own in your ass and get real on It feels like my flow's been hot for so long You thinkin' I'ma fucking fall off, you're so wrong You should be ready for a track and screw on You get stunned if you own in your ass and get real on It feels like my flow's been hot for so long You thinkin' I'ma fucking fall off, you're so wrong It's pretty